do you want a full review of a cable? I am not reviewing a cable. It works. This video is about it. It works. Get it on eBay. There's another version on Amazon, but there's a video of it being plugged into the surface and causing a spark. And don't get that one. Get this one. This is Ricky Lee 99 and let's just jump right into it. So what are we talking about today? We are today talking about the Surface Connect to USB-C charging cable. That's right, you heard it right. A Surface connector to a USB-C power cord. Why is that awesome? It means that I can charge my tablet. There will be a screen recording. I can charge my uh, Surface Book Pro with an external battery bank, which is great for traveling. It also means that I can travel with one less power adapter. I won't need the dedicated uh, Surface Connect connector as long as I bring my USB-C with power delivery. That's the big thing. You need a specific I'll screenshot this later, but you need to have a power USB-C power delivery power supply that can output 15 volts at 2 amps, which none of the Apple chargers do apparently. None of the Apple USB-C chargers work, but so far this RAV power battery pack works. The RAV power USB-C with power delivery adapter that's going to be on the screen. That works too. Uh, I, there's an Anchor or Anki one that I have at home that works too. So, really excited about this. I can now travel lighter with this thing. I can use this battery bank. And so, for some technical information, um, I don't notice a power it taking any longer than before to to charge. Uh, let me rephrase that. I don't notice any charging time difference between using this USB-C adapter and the original dedicated um, Microsoft Surface Pro charger. They seem to charge at the same rate. The only thing that I've observed, which every single person, every single review says to do, is that um, there's a specific order to plug everything in, and that um, you have to this is how you disconnect it. Disconnect the USB-C side first, and then remove the surface connector. Then you reverse it to plug everything in. You pop that in, you put in the USB-C parts, and then you turn on the power bank. You turn on your power charger. Uh, if I don't follow that little one, two, three, three, two, one kind of thing, it doesn't always detect. I don't know what's up with that, but Eh, this works. If you wanted a solution where you don't have to bring that power brick with you, this works. Uh, caveat, so you know, this does not make a USB-C, a true USB-C um, connector. It's only for charging. This is charge only. There is no data on it. Anyway, um, since that was really short, I made a skit earlier. Uh, Skip Ricky is going to end this video. This infamous The Cable. And as always, click the notification bell if you want to hit the, you want to be notified when I upload new videos. And until next time, I'm Ricky Lee 99 And you know, no, I, I don't have an outro. Can't think of an outro. Whatever the outro is, this ain't the outro. If you notice, I didn't mention the name of the cable because I completely forgot the name of the cable. The mouse that I talked about in the previous video. Yes, I am wearing the same shirt because this is 10 minutes after I recorded the last one. Don't complain, I will change my shirt after this video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway. <laughs>